What do you got for me? Call of the Voids. What? Have you ever driven down the road and thought about driving into oncoming traffic, but you don't? Yeah. I mean, yeah, you th you think about it, but it's not like you're considering it. It's not like a suicidal tendency. I think right. it's like a... Call of the Voids, that's what that's, that's what called? That's what they're called, yeah. Or if you like stand at the edge of a mountain and you think, oh, what would happen if I just jump? Yeah, you're just like, you I, I could do it. Huh. Yeah, I think about that, I guess. Do you have any, like, examples? Like, think about it every day. What? Does it count if you, like, envision stuff happening to you? I think so, yeah. I think about, my brother brought this up to me, and it ruined my life. Uh, I think about, like, all the possible car accidents you could you could have. Like, when you're driving, like, this person could hit me, or... I could back into this or or I could this person could cut me off and do all this. I think about that a lot while I'm driving. Yeah, it's probably normal. It's probably the human version of curiosity killed the cat. Yeah. So what did you have about uh about that? Do you have any personal just, a strong maybe reason that you brought it up or No, I've just thought of like like the human psychology behind it and like how our brains are like, like why we would even think about it. When do you do it? Mostly when I'm driving. Yeah? Yeah. Or it's like, even if you're walking like on a busy road and you're like, what if someone just like hit me? And yeah, for no reason, like. I would do that. I do that um, like when I was younger, when I was on a bike, not really afraid, but I would just think about like, what if someone just got up on the side and just hit me from behind? Or like if I was ever in the bike lane, that's what I would that's what I would be worried about. Yeah, because it could be not even like malicious. Like, what if someone driving had a seizure? And yeah, like... yeah, exactly. It just it just like could happen. Um, probably not fully related, but I don't like to be in like like uh, swimming in a large body of water because okay. I just imagine the implausible event of like you know being like swallowed by a large fish or something. I used to not like um, like walking home in the dark, and I would like just sprint. Like if I was coming it's probably like a house. fear of the unknown more than a fear yeah. of anything. Yeah, so I think that's not exactly the, what is it, Call of the Voids? Yeah, Call of the Void. Void? Yeah. No voids? I don't think it's plural. I thought you said voids. It could. I heard that sharks can smell blood, like how good their smell is for blood. Humans can smell rain that way. That's like why people, you've, have you ever heard someone say, hey, I, I can smell the rain coming? Coming, 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 coming. Not really. I've heard of people saying they can like feel it in their bad Arthritic joints, their knee. Joints. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I oh geez, I guess I'm gonna start to feel the rain in the small of my back, my lumbar. Sprained my lumbar. Sprained. I sprained it. How? I was working at a local alcohol <laughs> distributor. It was like a repeated. I had to grab like boxes and fling them over to onto a conveyor belt and just do that over and over and over again. Um, and one of the times I did it and just my, my back felt like it ripped apart. That was probably five, six years ago. Probably more than that. Maybe less than that. Maybe exactly that. I, I could look it up. Mm -hmm.